Hi everyone, so here are the words and phrases that I think are the most important if you only will learn just a little bit of Japanese before going to Japan. Number one being how to say thank you, and that's arigato gozaimasu. You could just say arigato, which means thanks, but in Japanese culture, um, they try to be super respectful, so they put the word gozaimasu at the end to show respect. So I would say arigato gozaimasu. You're going to use that a lot. Next would be, excuse me. That can mean, excuse me, maybe in the train station or a restaurant, maybe you're trying to get the waitress's um, attention. That is, sumimasen. Now you can also use this word if you accidentally bump into someone, you step on their toe, you take their seat, and you're trying to say, I'm sorry. And you just say, sumimasen, or, ah, sumimasen. So next you want to buy something and you want to know how much it costs. The phrase is ikuro desu ka? So you could point to something that you want to know um, and then say the words ikuro desu ka? Or even just say ikura with like a little question at the end and they'll understand what you mean. If you know the word, you would say, let's say you want a beer from the restaurant. The word for beer in Japanese is biru. So you would just say biru onegai shimasu or maybe water, mizu. Or even maybe sake. Sake onegaishimasu. And that would work for t shirts, pants, you know, anything that you would want. You just stick onegaishimasu at the end for that item, please. Next would be maybe you want to go to the bathroom because that's going to happen. So you can just say, Otore wa doko desu ka? So O is for respect, and tore means toilet. Doko is where, and desuka is the question. O tore wa doko desu ka? If that's too long, you can just say tore, like tore with a question at the end, and they'll understand what you mean, and they'll probably point like in this direction. And lastly, you need to know the word please, and that's onagaishimasu. You would put the item that you want, onagaishimasu. So, t shirts onagaishimasu. So that shirt, please. Or you want a beer? Biru onegaishimasu. So the same thing as putting the biru in front of how much does it cost? The subject always goes first and the verb goes at the end in Japanese. So if you only learn these things, you will have a better time、um, getting around Japan.、Uh, if you want to know more, let me know and I can、uh, post another video.